Welcome to the PZ Engineering channel, Passion to Excel. In this video, we are going to show how to simulate a charging control for a battery based on the pulse generator in MATLAB Simulink software. Before we start with our simulation, if you are not yet part of our family, please be part of our family by subscribing to our channel, share our contents, comment and like this video. You can as well donate to our channel in order to have a special attention on your request to have access to a certain models and to help us to keep on doing videos like this. Now let's get our components from our library browser. First, we are searching for our DC voltage source. We'll take our, our DC source. We'll take our series punch load. You can just follow everything that is here. Let's take our, our end and go. Now let's build, organize our system. our values here current uh, this would be our RL now let's put our RC those are the values let's change the value In our MOSFET, we don't change any any value. We're just going to isolate the switch or the measure point.
we are using this for the measurement purpose. Now let's develop our control which will be based on path generator. We are going to change the period and the path with percentage. The percentage is that is the one that determines if the battery is charging or discharging. Above 50, the battery is dis is dis is charging and below 50% the battery will be charging. Now let's let's put our switches which will be negative and at least no is our logic but uh, also we'll put our switches to be no and will be negative and positive. which will trigger our MOSFETs. Let's take our power GUI. Don't forget to subscribe to the channel, share our content, comment, and like this video. You can as well donate our channel in order to specifically donate. Now we, you are changing a DC voltage source voltage. You can also donate to our channel to have access to specific models and to the Gunners in your project. Now I think our system is okay. Now we can run and see the behavior of our system. As, as you can see, the battery was charging, but let's put our display, let's add this display. Let's run again, and we'll be changing our pulse generator. And we will see how our system will behave. As I say, above 50, above 50, is it will be charging the battery. And then when you reduce the percentage, it, it, it changes. As you put the 40, it changes. Now it's applying.
as we change above and below 50 it change the the voltage the current and the state of charge can the state of charge in ink it shows that the battery is charging or discharging thank you so much please don't forget to subscribe to our channel share our contents comment and like this video As you can see from our scope, different stages, the battery is charging, dis discharging, charging and discharging. As, it, it, as we can see, it influences the state of charge, the voltage and the current of the battery. Thank you so much for watching. Please don't forget to subscribe to the channel, share our contents, comment and like this video.